Hey guys, so today Apple has officially released yet another beta for iOS 18.5. Today releasing iOS 18.5 Developer Beta 4. Now aside from iOS 18.5 Beta 4, Apple also released iPadOS 18.5 Beta 4, WatchOS 11.5 Beta 4, TVOS 18.5 Beta 4, HomeOS 18.5 Beta 4, VisionOS 2.5 Beta 4, and MacOS 15.5 Developer Beta 4. Now, if you're a public beta tester, you'll most likely see this populate for you on your devices within the next 24 to 48 hours as per usual. Now, the download for this one was a little over 800 megabytes, as you can see right there, coming from Beta 3 to Beta 4. And as we take a look here at the latest build number, so let's head on over into general about iOS, right there it is. You see that the latest bill number does contain the letter A at the end of the bill number. So typically when we get the letter A towards the end of the bill number, that means that Apple will soon release the software to the general public. Now, although iOS 18.5 does not contain any drastic new features and changes, there are some under the hood improvements and minor tweaks within the software. This software does contain the one thing that iPhone users have been asking for, and that is stability, great performance, and great battery. Battery life. Now, this latest beta, beta 4, does contain some code referencing some new things happening before the official release, so let's go ahead and dive right in. So according to the latest reports, code within iOS 18.5 developer beta 4 does hint at two new wallpapers. So it appears that Apple is working on two new wallpapers set to release to the iPhone with iOS 18.5. Now, the latest beta, beta 4, does not contain any new wallpapers. Keep in mind that last year, with iOS 17.5, Apple did release a new Pride Collection wallpaper alongside a new Pride watch band and watch face. Now that will most likely become available once iOS 18.5 is officially released to the general public. Which brings me to the last topic. When will Apple release iOS 18.5 for everyone to download? Well, I'm thinking that next week on the week of the 5th, so Monday, May 5th, I think we'll see iOS 18.5 RC, the release candidate, and following week after that on the week of the 12th, so on Monday, the 12th, I think Apple will release iOS 18.5 to everyone worldwide with some of the latest new features and changes, under the hood improvements, the new wallpapers, and of course, this software, as I mentioned before, contains a lot of under the hood improvements in terms of great performance, great battery life, and I'm sure a lot of you guys are probably looking forward to that. So, although this software does not contain a major crazy new features and changes coming to the iPhone, it does contain what I believe most of you guys are looking forward to is excellent battery life, excellent performance, smooth stability, and everything else in between, which I'm happy to report. And that's across the board, by the way, because I've been testing multiple devices from iPhone 13 Pro, 14 Pro, 15 Pro, iPhone 11, and it seems like the performance is great across the board. The battery life continues to improve with every single beta. Even in beta 4 now, I'll continue testing and give you guys a feedback follow-up video in just a couple of days, so make sure to subscribe. Again, iOS 18.5, developer beta 4, now officially available to registered developers expect the rc sometime next week perhaps on monday and the official release the monday 12 following after that thank you for watching this quick update video i hope you guys found this information helpful and i'll see you guys on the next one peace